natural tendinitis treatment. A lot of people suffer from tendinitis in different areas of their body, such as the elbow, the heel, the shoulder, or the wrist, among other areas. However, a lot of these people just identify a pain, and don't know its cause or treatment. Tendinitis could be caused by an injury, which is what frequently happens to athletes, or from overloading the tendons when they are inflexible. Here we will provide a few remedies to effectively and naturally treat this. How do I know if I have tendinitis? The main symptoms of tendinitis is pain, which is located throughout the tendon, generally close to a joint. This pain can appear and disappear, and usually gets worse with exercise. If you have localized tendon pain that comes back every day, you should see a doctor. They will examine it and do relevant tests. Because treatment is generally based on regular consumption of anti-inflammatories, and because in a lot of cases, this condition does not improve easily, we will present a few natural remedies that have anti-inflammatory effects, without side effects. Appropriate diet. There are a few nutrients that are indispensable for naturally treating tendinitis. You can consume them in foods and or as natural supplements. Vitamin C, eat foods rich in vitamin C, citrus fruits, kiwi, raspberries, strawberries, papaya and, or take it as a supplement. You could also get used to squeezing a squirt of lemon juice on your food, or as a dressing on your salad. Magnesium, helps create collagen, fundamental for the skeleton, the tendons, and cartilage. It is consumed via foods, cacao, leafy greens, banana, dried fruit, and seeds or as a supplement as magnesium citrate or magnesium or magnesium chloride. It is best to avoid this last one if you suffer from heartburn. Vitamin E. Vitamin E is an antioxidant that protects body tissue from damage caused by substances called free radicals. They are found in leafy green vegetables. Broccoli, spinach, seeds, wheat germ, brewer's yeast, and egg yolk. Bioflavonoids, bioflavonoids or vitamin P, act as antioxidants because they help vitamin C to keep collagen levels balanced. It is found in citrus fruits, but mostly, in its skin. That's why we recommend using organic lemon and orange peels to add to salads, cakes, or smoothies. They are also found in grapes, cherries, apricot, rose hips, papaya, peppers, and buckwheat. Homemade poultices. You can make homemade poultices with medicinal herbs to alleviate tendinitis symptoms. Use the following plants. Comfrey, Symphatum officinal, this medicinal plant's name refers to its wound strengthening. It has important beneficial effects on all types of contusions and fractures because it is a greatly regenerative for tissues. It should always be applied externally however, as internal use could be toxic. Turmeric, curcum longa, 
as important antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, and anti-carcinogenic effects. It can also be eaten with foods. Arnica, Arnica Montana, one of the best known natural anti-inflammatories. Preferably, you should obtain these plants fresh. Crush them in a mortar and pestle, and apply them directly to the area you would like to treat, covering them with a bandage. Do not wrap too tight. If you get them dry, cook them with a very small amount of water, and then apply to the skin in the same way. Cover with a cloth so it doesn't run. Arnica stands out among these plants. It is possibly best known among athletes, and people who suffer from inflammatory problems, because it is amply used in natural and homeopathic medicine for its anti-inflammatory strength. This plant can be found in creams, tinctures, homeopathy, etc. If you decide to use homeopathy, use Arnica Montana 9CH, and place three balls under your tongue, three times a day. Separate them from meals, drinks, and strong flavors or mint, gum, toothpaste, etc. Clay poultices. Clay poultices are a very useful ancient remedy for alleviating pains caused by inflammation. You can use green or red clay, and mix it with warm water until it turns into a uniform paste. Instead of water. You could also use an infusion with any of the previously mentioned medicinal plants. Apply the poultice for 20 minutes, then wash well with warm water. These clay poultices should be used once or twice a week.